The safety of American people is my absolute highest priority. We are sparing no expense. Uh, we are totally prepared. We're ready. Uh, we're as ready as anybody's ever been. And uh, it looks to me and it looks to all of a lot of very talented people that do this for a living like this is going to be a storm that's going to be a very large one, far larger than we've seen in perhaps decades. Uh, things can change, but we doubt they will at this stage. It's a pretty late stage. We doubt they're going to be veering very far off course. The places that are in the way and in the most jeopardy would be Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, that area. And again, they haven't seen anything like what's coming at us in uh, 25, 30 years, maybe ever. It's tremendously big and tremendously wet. Tremendous amounts of water. What's your message, Mr. President, to people who might not have evacuated yet? Well, that's very risky. I mean, uh, again, we've never seen anything quite like this on the East Coast, at least. And if it turns out to be as bad, you know, we, we go out there. You have, you have people that actually go fly through these storms. Uh, these are very brave people, but they fly through. And from what I'm hearing, the sights that they're seeing have not been seen on the East Coast before. So I would say everybody should get out. I mean, you have to listen to your local authorities. And whether you're upland or downland, but depending on where you are, you have to listen and you have to get out. If they want you to get out, because it's going to be impossible to have people get in there, whether it's law enforcement or FEMA or anybody else, once this thing hits, it's going to be really, really bad along the coast. Okay?